Hey guys, it's Betty from We Are Word Nerds, and this is a Book of the Day video. Today's video is a little bit different. I'm going to try to post this video up on Wednesday, and we're going to call it a Watch It Wednesday post. Basically, what I want to do is um, every now and then on Wednesdays, instead of just posting a random book of the day, I want to talk about a book that has also been made into a movie. So the first Watch It Wednesday book I wanted to feature was Jaws by Peter Benchley. This book was originally published on January 1st, 1974 by Bantam Books. I actually picked my copy up at the Salvation Army for I think it was 50 cents and then we were at a yard sale and I got another copy of it for 50 cents. So there is actually a copy of this in the giveaway box right now seen the movies or read the book I just want to tell you a little bit about what Jaws is about basically um, Chief Brody is the police chief on this little like island resort town outside of New York and somehow this great white gets there and it decides that it's gonna have this vendetta against the chief so pretty much the whole movie is a slasher horror film, but instead of a serial killer, you have a shark. The book is really short. It's about 300 pages long. It is a very quick read. It is very tense. And in fact, the book was so good and so well written that they released it as the movie in 1975. The movie was directed by Steven Spielberg and one of the screenwriters was Peter Benchley himself. So the movie kept a lot of the same tenseness and I don't want to say thrill but like that's really that's really what it was and and it's so good as a horror film even for that time that a lot of the scenes hold up their intensity even as today uh, the main characters in the book and in the movie are Chief Brody who in the movie is played by Roy Schneider Quint who is the most amazing character is played by Robert Shaw and he probably has one of the most iconic horror movie scenes of all time. And of course the scientist that they bring in, Hooper, is played by Richard Dreyfus. There's not really anything that I can tell you about the book or the movie that's not spoilerish because it's a movie about a shark. You're gonna know what happens. Um, I highly recommend the book if you haven't read it. I highly recommend watching the movie if you haven't seen it. I even highly recommend reading the book and watching the movie back to back just so you don't lose contact with the feelings that you had when you were reading the book. Alright you guys, so this is the first Watch It Wednesday video. I'm sure as I do them they'll get a little better planned out, have a few more features. I do have a few things I want to do like work in some clips from the films and things like that, but I need to check into copyright and figure out how that's all going to work on YouTube. But um, if you like this video, if you like having themed Book of the Days, please comment down below and let me know or thumb up the video. That way I know this is something that you want to keep seeing. If you've read Jaws, please comment down below and let me know what you thought. I thought it was amazing. Spoiler alert. Um, yeah, so I guess that's it. This is the first Watch It Wednesday video. On to the next, you guys. Thanks for watching. See ya.